Hi y'all. Welcome back to the channel. Welcome if it's your first time here. Um, I know I haven't made a video in a while. Uh, I've been very, very super busy. Um, I have <clears throat> um, something to share with y'all. Uh, so this is the video about why I have not had time to do a video lately. I've uh, been very busy with a project let's say, just say a project, so I hope y'all enjoy it, um, it's been so much fun, uh, so much, so educational, and I've just really enjoyed this, and it's been like three weeks since I post, since I've, um, made a video or put anything up, I think, it might even be longer than that, but like I said, I hope you enjoy this video, because I sure had fun making it, um, had a, it was an emotional, emotional roller coaster, but uh, it's over with the emotional roller coaster so far. But uh, I hope y'all enjoyed this video, and uh, I think you will. So here we go. Enjoy, y'all. Been working on an experiment. I've never told y'all about this, but we're ready to go into lockdown. These are my quail eggs, but y'all didn't know that I was incubating, and here they are. And we're going into lockdown in the next few hours. That means that uh, there's Within three days, they're supposed to supposed to hatch. So let's just see what happens. I'm excited. I'm nervous. <laughs> oh Lord, just don't ever know what I'm gonna get get myself get me into. Me myself and I get get myself in trouble a lot. Maybe it won't be trouble. So far, so good. It's been fun. And as they progress, I will video what I can. But yeah. So I'm going to be busy in the next few days, probably waiting to see what happens here. Yeah. So everything's looking good. I'm getting ready to try to get that humidity up because you're supposed to get it up to 60 around 60 for the um, lockdown days so I gotta see if I can get that on up uh, I, mean, I think I just need to put fill it with more with water and uh, it's got a little spigot right here I filled it with water but uh, I don't think it's all the way full but it also has a little tab that goes on it that I think helps helps the humidity to stay in so, and that goes right there. So, I'm going to put that on there. But, okay, y'all. Just a little here we go video. Um, like, subscribe, and share. And uh, this is going to be probably a process. Um, so, I'll let you know what goes on uh, tomorrow. And this is September the 8th, Friday, the sep September the 8th, 8th, 2023. And uh, by Monday, I'm thinking by Monday, I should start hearing some little chirp, chirp, chirp sounds. We shall see. Okay. Okay, so uh, we went on in, into day three. If you push this button right here on uh, the incubator, it'll tell you how many days you have left. So this evening it went it went to day three because I had um, you push it again and it'll go back there. It goes back on the temperature. Um, <clears throat> so so I had had started them out on an uh, an evening. So uh, that's that's why it went already went on uh, day three. 
So uh, I'm I'm looking. Uh, let's see. Um, so it might be in between Sunday and Monday when they start hatching. So because uh, this is Friday, and one more thing I wanted to tell y'all. Um, the uh, I was reading up on the incubator, and uh, this is a Nurture Right 360, and um, uh, to get the temperature up, and I said 60 degrees. I need to correct that. Uh, it's it should be in between 65 and 75 uh, for the the, uh, uh, the remainder of the lockdown days. <coughs> the remainder uh, or, or for the thir uh, the three day lockdown time, um, and you uh, you pour your water into. I poured my water into both uh, spots uh, because uh, this is A and this is B because uh, A need a little bit more. Seems like it evaporates pretty fast. Uh, and then I fill B up and put the little tab back on it. And uh, uh, you're supposed to open the little valve right here, um, wide open. And uh, the next few hours it should regulate, It should uh, the humidity should regulate um, to 65 uh, to 75. So we're on 62. So... I guess that's that's pretty good. So I'm getting up there. But I just wanted to let y'all know we're on day three already. My goodness. So we're on lockdown. It's got three days to go. Um yeah. So nervous, excited at the same time. Okay, y'all. I'll let you know how it goes. Okay, y'all. We're in the day two. Um, got the, uh, humidity up to 66, it's, uh, runs around 66, 67, uh, it's supposed to be in between 65 and 75, so we're doing good, um, we're going to be going into, uh, day one of lockdown, it'll be the end of the lockdown, um, this evening so let's see what happens and everything so far so good everything's doing good I got my uh, little nozzle here it is Oops. it's about halfway shut maybe but it seems to help it stay up to you know six in between 65 and uh, 75 so, all right then, I'll be back later when we go into day one, and so far so good. Um, I don't know if I said this or not, but I've got 21, 21 eggs in there, and uh, so we shall see what happens. All righty, that was just an update. We're almost there. Okay, this is Sunday. Um, they should be going into um, hatch mode tomorrow, uh, tomorrow evening. So let's see what happens. <clears throat> Excited. <laughs> okay. Okay, um, day one. Um, the humidity's holding about 70. Um, so we only got a few more hours before we go into day two. I'm sorry, we've got a few more hours before we go into zero, <laughs> the hatch day. So, it won't be long, a few more hours, and hopefully we'll have some little babies, maybe. I'm hoping. I'm getting scared and anxious and everything. Okay. All right, y'all, see you in a little bit. Let's see what happens. Okay, y'all. Um, <clears throat> we're on day zero. Um... I want to show y'all this. Okay. Day zero, zero. Okay, and I'll go back on temperature. <clears throat> but I was, um, this little egg right here, um, I'm not sure if it's what they call pipping. Um, it's when they start cracking the egg open. It kind of looks like it might be, but I'm not positive. Now, uh, that's what it looks like to me. I don't recall that being on that egg before. 
So, um, but, uh, so we're just gonna have to wait, watch and wait, and I think it'll take, uh, I don't know, it could take an hour, could take, uh, it might not be until tomorrow, I don't know yet. So I don't see any more on the other eggs, but I'm looking to see if I can see any more. Um, but uh, I'll keep y'all updated, okay. Okay, y'all, um, I have noticed several others that are called pipping. It's, it's spelled P-I-P-P-I-N-G. So when they start breaking the little, breaking the eggs, the shell to come out, rather. Um, I got this flashlight on because you can see better. Well, I could see better before. Hold on. Uh, this one right here. That one? You can see it. Okay. I'm trying to shine the flashlight because it was easier to see with the flashlight before. Okay. There. There's another one. Okay. And then the, what the first one we saw. He still hadn't very made very much progress. Um, hasn't made very much progress. Now there's one over here, way over there. I don't know if we can see it or not. Is that it's actually got a little piece coming out well y'all um, my electric went out the power went out about 30 to 45 minutes ago right as the babies are trying to hatch as y'all can see so, here's what i done. The incubator is inside my car. I have a, an adapter that plugs into my cigarette lighter and it's actually running the incubator for me. Thank God. Is that, it's gonna be upside down because I'm on the other side of the car. So, it's, uh, the temperature's good and the humidity. It's a little over 70, it's 76, it's supposed to be in, be in between 70, uh, it's supposed to be in between 65 and 75, so that's not bad, so, um, but I'm just hoping this, that our power comes back on, um, because I've gone this long, and, see, we have, we have them trying to hatch here. I have several. Actually, most most of them are pit uh, are pipped. They have cracks in them. Um, so I'll let y'all know what happens. Hopefully, everything will be okay. I'm just so thankful that uh, I have this adapter in my car. The only thing, the only bad thing is my gas is low. Of course, Ugh. but hopefully, I won't run out of gas before they get our before they get our power back on. Um, just an update. I'm hoping everything is going to go okay, even after all this. They did get moved around a little bit uh, when I was bringing them from the house. Um, I'm just hoping that it doesn't affect them. I don't think it will. I'm hoping it won't because uh, I, I do see signs of them still trying to move around and stuff. So I'll keep y'all up, updated, and of course this is going to happen. I'm not, it's crazy, so crazy. I know. Oh, I'm just praying for him. I'm praying that everything everything goes okay, even after this setback. We shall see. Come on. Then we got this little fella that just popped out. I'm talking about. 
just now popped out. And slow and go. It actually took like a day longer, so I might have been off by my days, but I don't, uh, I'm not sure. But they are hatching. They are hatching. There you go. trying to trying to get out unnoticed so okay we'll be back let these little fellas hatch <laughs> trying to get out of that egg right there the old fellas cute got one that's trying to come out right here won't be long well, we have three that's hatched. He's trying. He's trying. charge my phone real quick so I can maybe maybe record this one hatch we'll see he's trying to get out we've got three so far this little fella here he's coming on out looks like here he comes he ain't wasting no time. Mm -hmm.
Okay, he's unzipped that shell. He's about ready to make his grand entrance. Let's see. Up, kick open, kick that little shell off. I think it's getting there. This will be number four. We've already got, already got three. Over there, in the little corner over there. There he goes. That looks like he's getting the egg right there. A little bit more, and you'll be out of there. Yeah, you're getting there. You were getting there. I'm not wasting very much time now, but man, it was slow and go before. I was wanting to grind the quail. Why aren't they hatching? Why aren't they hatching? <laughs> and now they're hatching.
I heard him chirping, but that there wasn't there wasn't any that was catching all the way. There one had one had a little hole in the egg. These guys right here are just serious. They're seriously wanting to get hatched. Here he comes, here he comes, here he comes. Won't be long now. He'll plop on out. Come on, baby. Come on, you're almost there. Almost there. You're almost there. Here he comes, he's coming on out. He's almost got it. He gets that little bottom part, up, part off and he's, he's out of there. Here he comes, here he comes, here he comes. And wiggle one out. And away from the shell. There he is. Oh, happy birthday, baby. <laughs> happy birthday, baby. Yeah, look at you. Kick off that egg. And go over there and join your brothers and sisters over there. Mm -hmm. Kick out of there. One or two more good kick kicks and you should be out of that shell. Come on, that's it, that's it, that's it, that's it. <gasps> Look at you. Look at you. Look at you. You're almost out. And they do roll around too when they're trying to get out of that egg. Almost got it. A little bit more. <laughs> got to rest a minute because it's a big ordeal. Yeah, there you go, there you go. Come on. Come on. You almost got that shell off of you. 
Look at you. Look at you. <laughs> Look at you. Say it's your birthday, everybody. It's my birthday. I just gotta give us this show up with my booty. I gotta get this show off my booty and I'm out. There I am. I did it. 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 Happy birthday, baby. He's got a little bit of the, of the egg yolk on him, on him but it, he'll be alright. That the egg will fall off. That's probably just a, that's probably just a membrane from the shell. It'll fall off. He'll go over there. See the other three are over here. <laughs> they're they're pecking already. Oh my goodness. They are pecking already. <laughs> Okay, you got a little sibling fixing to come over there and join y'all. Soon, as soon as he can get his bearings straight. See, I'm getting my bearings straight, folks. I was just born. Say it's my birthday, everybody. Say it's my birthday. Yep, it's my birthday. All right, let me see what I can do. Can I get up here and walk? Not yet. You got to get your balance. Yeah. Yeah. So I got to get my balance. That little piece of membrane can fall off, hopefully, while he's trying to get his balance. But if not, it'll fall off. It'll fall off. It's not no big deal. There's number four. We have four babies. We have four babies out of the shell. Yes, we do. We do. Four babies out of the shell. All right. He hears their mother. I bet you he's going to go up there to where they're at. That's what the other two did. Or the other, that's what the other, yeah, the other two did. They, they went over to the first one that was hatched. All right, there he goes. He's going. He says, I hear trippers over here. Some trippers like me. He said, I hear some trippers. Let me go over here and see these trippers. Let me go over here and see these trippers. What are y'all doing over there? Hey, y'all. Hey, siblings. Say, hey, siblings. Hi. Well, hello, siblings. Hello, siblings. I'm a little wobbly, but I'm coming. <laughs> I'm trying to get it to where the light's there. All right, we got four babies. We got four babies. See what happens next. This is the middle of the night, y'all, and I'm not filming this instead of sleeping. <laughs> All right. All right. Awesome. 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 That was awesome. Okay, we got we got eight, and this one here is getting ready to pop out. He's working on it. They are the cutest little things, and they're so tiny. See, we are so tiny. We get so tiny. Yeah, we're just so tiny. <laughs> They're adorable. They are adorable little babies. But this egg right here, he is pecking his way out.
I think the egg right there beside it, it might be going to going to uh, start pretty soon, start uh, hatching. But he is well on his way out there, or she. That's right. Time to make our grand entrance. That one right there, I think, is going to, too, because it's got, it's got some little pipping going on. And over here he is just he's out like a light can y'all see him is just tired he said that was so hard work trying to get out that egg that was a hard work he's trying to take a nap <laughs> so we're little we're adorable Here he comes, here he comes, y'all. Here he comes. Once they get that outlining done on that egg, it, it goes pretty fast. Here he goes. Oh, are you going to help? Uh, oh, hold on here. You don't need to do that. Are you helping? Are you helping? Say, come on, get out there. Get out of that egg. Say, come on. Get on up out of that egg and join us. Join your siblings. Mm. Say, I'm trying to help you. Come on, come on, help. I'm helping you, I'm helping you. Get out, get out of there, get out of there. Come on, get out. <laughs> oh my gosh, I can't believe I'm, I'm getting this on video. Are you helping them? Say, get your legs out. Kick them, kick, kick your legs. He's almost out, and that didn't take very long. Didn't take, and then he's got somebody over here trying to help him. <sighs> yeah, what are you doing? Are you trying to help your sibling get out of that egg? Huh? Are you helping them get out of the egg? And here comes another one. Y'all helping your siblings hatch. That's pretty cool. Mm -hmm. Say, I'm just trying to get out. Y'all just, y'all been bar bombarding me. I'm trying to get out of here. Y'all just coming. Y'all just getting my, all up in my space. Y'all up in my space. I'm trying to hatch. <sighs> Kick them off and, and do your little thing. Kick that egg off. There you go. You're doing it. You're doing it. Here he comes. Happy birthday. Happy birthday. Meet your siblings. Are you meeting? Meet your siblings. <laughs> oh, my goodness. It's amazing to witness. Yes, it is. It's awesome. You kick out of there. Kick, kick, kick. Kick it off. Kick it off. Get out of there. Oop, 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 oop. He's almost, he's almost got it off. He's, he's almost got it off. And everybody's coming over to see, to meet their new sibling. Oh, yeah. Say, oh yeah, I am getting out. I'm getting out. <laughs> Happy birthday. Happy birthday, little fella. Happy, happy birthday. There he goes, there he goes. 
y'all crowding him. You're crowding him. He can't get he can't get around because y'all too many people's in the way. Too many siblings in the way. Gotta get his strength up and get out of that, get out of, uh, his little butt stuck on the, um, shell there. But I think he can pull it off. Uh, there he goes. That, that little membrane's still attached. But he'll pull it off. So I will pull it off and I will get out of this. I will get away from that shell. That's a way, buddy. That's a way. Get it. Get it. Get it. They're so little. They are so, so little. Are you helping him? Help him. Help him out. Say, come on. Get out of there. Get out of that shell, buddy. Come on. You can do it. You can do it. You can do it. Say, come on. You got it. You got it. You're out of that shell now. Ugh. He hop around and get that shell, all the, the membrane, detached, and he'll be all right. See, well, I'm just pulling my shell around. I'm pulling it around like a turtle. <laughs> Say happy birthday. Happy, happy birthday. We got another one, y'all. We got another sibling. Yes, we do. Yes, we do. He's going to pull it all. He's going to pull that fell off. Looks like they're trying to help him out. Oh, he's done. He said, I'm tired. I gotta rest. That was hard work. Trying to get out of that shell. I was just working at it and working at it. And now I'm out. There him is. Yeah. Look at him. They're just like. There's y'all's little sibling. Cutest little things in the world. My goodness gracious. Adorable. Say, we is adorable. We is adorable. We is adorable. Yeah, we is adorable. <laughs> it's like they're trying to get him to move get him to get up on his feet uh, yeah the membrane's pulled off is he's pulled away from a shell now i believe i believe they helped him <laughs> 
Oh, no, not yet. But they're trying. They're trying to help him, looks like. Get the rest of that shell <clears throat> detached. I think that one last little hop there, I think he's detached from the shell now. He's doing all right. He's just sitting over here trying to stay warm like the rest of them. It's like, oh, I'm tired out. I just gotta, I just gotta lay down and rest. Oh. Okay, that's number nine. Number nine, and this one right here, I think it's gonna be next, maybe. It's starting to have some pitting and pipping. It's called pipping, not pitting. Um, so yeah, I gotta. Okay, I got things to do. I got other animals to take care of. So I'll be back, y'all, so we can see how many more hatch. Awesome. Okay, so I had a total of 19 uh, of my quail birds to hatch and uh, one of them did not hatch um, so I, I candled it and um, I saw um, just a little small embryo so it had actually what they call it's what they call a quitter so it starts out but it just doesn't it just doesn't make it and it happens in chicks too so um, and, uh, baby chickens um, so Here's the here's the uh, the ones that hatched out, and uh, this is going to be on another clip because my the brooder is actually um, in a it's actually in my closet because I've got a big walk-in closet, so it's actually in my closet, and I have to clean it out every day. And I just want to apologize to my my little granddaughter because I told her I'd get this video up and it's been a while, and I'm sorry, baby, I'm sorry, but here it is. I hope you enjoy it. It's really cute. I think you. I think it's a cute uh, little video for kids to to watch. And uh, so here it is, sweetheart. Um, sorry it took Gigi so long to make another video, but uh, so here's the babies. And uh, it's been a really, it's been a an experience. So I hope y'all enjoy them. Well, here they are in the brooder. And uh, let me tell you what, they're messy. They are messy. And they tend to eat a lot, too. People say they don't eat that much. Um, or so I've heard that, and no. Even little baby ones eat a lot. So I'm finding out. But uh, aren't they just adorable? Adorable. Don't have their food thing in there right now, but that probably is what they're searching for, something to eat. Okay. But that's the outcome, y'all. It was it was a great experience. It's exciting. It was an emotional roller coaster because it took it took uh it didn't just they didn't just hatch them one day. It took three days for them to hatch. For them all to hatch. So it's a process. Um, so if you think some of them's not going to hatch, just keep on. Just um, just you know, just wait because they will hatch, um, or most of them will. Now you probably not a hundred percent hatch rate, but um, I was just very pleased with what I got, and uh, yeah. So 
that's what I've been busy doing here lately, y'all. Okay. Like, subscribe, and share, and I'll see you on the next video. Bye-bye.